for me, sobriety, staying off the liquor at this point, I don't, I don't view it as much of an issue, but what I do is I talk about it constantly. I yeah. talk about my alcoholism and my mental health uh, trials and triumphs regularly. Right. As, 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 to people who I work with, to people uh, you know, at the school there with my kids, I pick them up and they go, you know, I, I'm not just going, I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> but, but I do, I do keep it current in, in my conversation to keep me yeah. on because I'm really worried yeah. that if I stop talking about it, it's going to become too easy. Right. And my, my job historically is working in restaurants. Most recently was working, uh, behind a bar. So I, I put it out there very quickly so that people know that if you see old JD going for a drinky, it's not supposed to happen, right? Right. It's and your be, you, way of being accountable to yourself, right? You're 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 building accountability partners yeah. everywhere you go by talking about this and being open and, and honest. And you'd be amazed, right? Because folks like you and and people like us at large talk about it a lot now. Yeah, it's we do. It's not like it was uh, when I started in restaurants 20 years ago, where right. you don't drink like nothing, right? And it was yeah. almost like, ew. What's wrong with you? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. dude, yeah. come on. Do one, right? Now, people that you barely even know are on your side. Yeah. Right? I told yeah. someone on my first shift I don't drink, and they went, okay, cool. If I ever see you catching a drink, man, we're going to have problems. I don't know you. Yeah. That's amazing. You ain't the boss of me, but. Right. But now I'm accountable because yes. they know that the boss there is a good pal of mine. Yeah. And they'll wrap me out real quick. Yeah, <laughs> which which will not end well for anyone. So it's it's amazing sure. to see that people are aware of these things being actual issues, uh, yeah. aware enough to want to help people with it and and yeah. to back people up for it. You know, I used to right after some well not right after sobriety, but shortly after sobriety, when I was feeling a little bit more comfortable, and me and my wife would go out, I would order a Virgin Caesar, right which I never drank when I was boozing, but it it made me feel like I was not going to have eyeballs on me, right? Like you're, right. Out, at a, you're out at a at a bar having a coffee. What's the matter with you, right? Yeah. Now I don't care because yeah. other people don't care. And, and it's funny because it, we realize that they don't care and that our drinking or not drinking, I mean, our not drinking is generally received much more, like much more, um, uh, openly and kindly than yeah. our drinking ever Much was, more favorably, right? and, yeah. Yeah, and um, yeah, I can really relate to that because I had that for a long time too. I was like, oh, I'll just get a soda water with lime so it'll look like a drink. And mm -hmm. then I started realizing, like, I don't, I mean, whether I like that to drink or not, why Why am I doing that to appease other people to, to either avoid the questions or, and I mean, for the, the few times that I'm in a, bar yeah like maybe i'm going to see a friend's mm -hmm. band play or something like that yeah. it doesn't matter and i can order i can have a bottle of water and be like completely fine and i actually notice more when i'm in a in a licensed establishment drinking a bottle of water i notice everybody that has another bottle yeah. of water too and i'm like yeah. wow i'm really not alone here yeah. maybe like when, these people are in recovery but yeah. yeah then you see all the blue that car before yeah. and then there they are yeah sure sure and 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 I think that's really important too to, you know, um, to 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 realize like in recovery that what our our perception of what other people think of us is so so askew, right? Like we people don't care as much as we would like to think that they do. Brother, I right? spent so much time in my head like overanalyzing everything, and I, and, you know, an hour will go by and I go, I'm the only one doing this. Like, yeah. Like, like about about this situation. I'm sure other people are overanalyzing theirs as well, but like, yeah. no one noticed what I noticed. 